Hello, you're welcome to solve this math problem, which is x plus 5 bracket factorial over x plus 1 bracket factorial is equal to 360. To find the value of x from this equation. Now, from here in the numerator, we make to have common this in the denominator x plus 1 bracket factorial. So this x plus 5 bracket factorial is same as x plus 5 bracket times x plus 4 bracket times x plus 3 bracket times x plus 2 bracket times x plus 1 bracket factorial. Then over this in the denominator which is x plus 1 bracket factorial is equal to this 360. Then in the next step we simplify this x plus 1 factorial will cancel with this x plus 1 factorial. Then we are left with this which is x plus 5 bracket bracket x plus 4 bracket bracket x plus 3 bracket bracket x plus 2 bracket is equal to 360. Then in the next step, we'll take this x plus 5 times this x plus 2. So it will be bracket bracket x plus 5 bracket times x plus 2 bracket then bracket. Then bracket, we we'll take this x plus 4 times this x plus 3. So it will be bracket x plus 4 bracket bracket x plus 3 bracket then bracket is equal to this 360. Then in the next step it will be x times x is x square. x times 2 it will be plus 2x then plus 5 times x is 5x. 5 times 2 is 10, so it will be plus 10, then bracket, bracket, x times x is x square, x times 3 to be plus 3x, 4 times x it will be plus 4x, then plus 4 times 3 it will be plus 12, bracket is equal to 360. Then in the next step, it will be this x square, then plus 2x plus 5x it will be 7x then plus 10 bracket bracket this x square then plus 3x plus 4x is 7x then plus 12 bracket is equal to 360 then from here x square plus 7x x square plus 7x is common then in here we have 10 12 so we make to have to, to have common quadratic equation. So this it will be x square plus 7x then plus from here 10 10 is same as 11 minus 1. So we make to have common quadratic equation of this x square plus 7x plus 11. Then bracket bracket here it will be x square plus 7x then plus this 12 is same as 11 plus 1 now from here 10 is 11 minus 1 12 is 11 plus 1 then bracket is equal to 360 then in the next step this quadratic equation x square plus 7x plus 11 is common so we will let u is equal to x square plus 7x plus 11. So this will be u minus 1. Then bracket, bracket, u plus 1. Bracket is equal to 360. Then in the next step, this is in the form of a perfect square. So we'll apply a perfect square rule, which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket 
whereas this is in this form so we change into this form whereas a it is u and b it is 1 so into this form it will be a square it will be u square then minus b square b is 1 so it will be 1 square which is 1 is equal to this 360 then in the next step we take this 1 negative 1 into this side so it will be u square is equal to 360 plus 1 is 361 then we apply square root in both sides so this square root will cancel with square then it will be u is equal to square root of 361 is plus or minus 19 then but before we recall before we let this u it is this quadratic equation x square plus 7x plus 11 so from u which is x square plus 7x plus 11 is equal to this plus or minus 19 then from here we have two so solution because of plus or minus so so let's write here the first solution it will be x square plus 7x plus 11 is equal to when it is positive to be 19 and the second solution when it is negative it will be this which is x square plus 7x plus 11 is equal to this negative 19 then in the next step the, we take this 19 into the left side so it will be x square plus 7x plus 11 then minus 19 is equal to 0 and here to be x square plus 7x then plus 11 minus 19 is negative 8 is equal to 0 and from here to be x square plus 7x plus 11 this negative 19 we take to this side to be plus 19 is equal to 0 then it will be x square plus 7x plus 11 plus 19 it is 30 is equal to 0 then we check this quadratic equations if it will give a real solution or not a real solution because we will find the quadratic equation which will give a real solution so from from discriminant formula which is equal to b square minus 4ac then it will be discriminant is equal to b square is this 7 7 square minus 4 then times a a is 1 times c c is negative 8 then it will be discriminant is equal to 7 square is 49 negative 4 times negative 8 it is positive 32 then it will be discriminant is equal to this plus this is 81 whereas this value is it is greater than 0 so it will give a real solution and to check from here from discriminant formula it will be discriminant is equal to b square it will be 7 square then minus 4 times a a is 1 times c c is 30 then it will be discriminant is equal to 7 square is 49 minus 4 times 30 is 120 then 49 minus 120 the value it is less than 0 so if it give the value is less than 0 then there is no real solution in this quadratic equation so this solution will reject it reject it then we'll continue to solve from this solution whereas we have this quadratic equation so we can solve this quadratic equation by grouping and factorization so from this quadratic equation which is x square plus 7x minus 8 is equal to 0 then it will be x square then plus 7x is same as 8x minus x then minus 8 is equal to 0 
then from here x is common so we take x out of bracket x squared divided by x is x then plus 8x divided by x is 8 bracket in here negative 1 we take out of bracket negative x divided by negative 1 is x negative 8 divided by negative 1 it will be 8 bracket is equal to 0 then from here x plus 8 is common so we take x plus 8 out of bracket then this divided by this is x then this divided by this is negative 1 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas the first solution is this x plus 8 is equal to 0 and the second solution is this x plus negative 1 is equal to 0 so in here we're taking 8 to the right side to be x is equal to negative 8 and here we're taking negative 1 to the right side to be x is equal to 1 so from here we have two solutions now to check if this solution will give a valid a valid solution from our problem whereas from our problem it is x plus 5 bracket factorial over x plus 1 bracket factorial is equal to 360 now from this denominator so as to give a valid solution this denominator for this x plus 1 it should be greater than or equal to 0 so when we take 1 into the right side to be x is greater than or equal to negative 1 now if the value of x should be greater than or equal to negative 1 then let's check our solution this it is less than negative 1 so this solution will reject it and this it is greater than the greater than negative 1 so this is the correct solution x is equal to 1 now if we substitute the value of x is 1 into this our problem it will be 1 plus 5 is 6 so it will be 6 factorial over 1 plus 1 it is 2 so to be 2 factorial is it equal to 360 then for this 6 factorial to have common 2 factorial 6 factorial is same as 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 factorial then over this 2 factorial is equal to 360 then this 2 factorial you can say this 2 factorial so it will be 6 times 5 it is 30 then times 4 times 3 it is 12 is it equal to 360 then 12 times 3 it is 36 then with this one zero is equal to 36 now left side and right side are equal then it is true for the value of x is equal to 1 thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out, subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.